Uh, so my name is Jen Vogus, and I'm from Brentwood, Tennessee, and I am a Partners in Policymaking graduate. I went through the program in 2006-2007, um, and I have a son. My son Aiden is uh, going to be 16 very soon, and he has a disability. Both you and your husband have gone through Partners. What impact has Partners had on your family? So my son Aiden uh, has a seizure disorder, and uh, my husband and I helped pass two bills um, in the uh, Tennessee State Legislature that allows for CBD oil to, to be obtained by seizure patients. So um, partners in policy making, we are so thankful we went through the program because it really gave us the tools to navigate the whole legal process. It gave us tools to talk to our legislators um, so we really feel like because of Partners in Policymaking, we have become effective advocates uh, for a cause that we believe in, not only for our son, but for other Tennesseans as well who are experiencing the same thing, um, despite the fact that it seemed like an overwhelmingly difficult thing to achieve. The Council has been supporting and funding Partners in Tennessee for nearly 25 years. What do you think this says about the Council, and why is it an important investment for us to make in Tennessee? I am so thankful that the um, Council on Development of Disabilities has supported the Partners in Policymaking program for almost 25 years now. Um, and by doing this, it really shows their deep commitment to um, you know, promoting best practice and empowering people with disabilities. Um, it's such an important investment because I believe that the council is really transforming the state of Tennessee to be an inclusive place for people to live and work and play. And, you know, they're implementing systemic change that helps um, with these goals. So, um, you know, and I think that this makes the state of Tennessee a better place for all people, not just people with disabilities.